Hello again. Wow, we are still playing Shining Force 3 Scenario 2, believe it or not. Uh, let's see, do we have some places still uh, sort of, you know, unchecked? It's kind of hard to tell though. Yeah, well, I'm, I'm just going to pretend there aren't. Let's see, what do we have on the... Uh, Checklist. Mm. Yeah, okay, I guess it's no big deal. Okay. Uh, not in the way I was expecting it, but um, let's see, there's the door. Next step is going in here and climbing up onto the roof. We should eventually get another party member here. Kind of looking forward to that. Uh, I've been waiting for this since um, scenario one, after all. Um, <laughs> so anything here, maybe? Might as well check it out before I get too far ahead. Oh yeah, herb. Are you me? Mind me while I just loot the place a little. <laughs> he does not care. Okay. How about the guy in here? Yeah. He's shot all the shelves. How dare you? Okay. That's not the kind of thing I am used to hearing. Guess it takes all sorts. Now, through here we should find a little uh, chest. Uh, can't see. We've got trouble. Big trouble. Oh, really now? This is the boss here. Giraffe says hi. I'm here. What is it? Well, out with it. We were scouting around in Imperial territory like you ordered. While in the cargo area of Railhead we... Morons. You went to Railhead. That is Garvin's territory. You better not have taken any of Garvin's property. Ah, so this is pretty close after the uh, fight where we get Irene in scenario 1. Okay. Good to know. He doesn't take these things lightly. No telling what kind of revenge awaits us if we anger him. Well, um, I didn't think... I'll have to take care of that myself. As long as his property was not taken, we should be alright. Now what's this big trouble you were yelling about? In the cargo hold at Railhead, we saw Symbios and his army. Well, why didn't you say so already? In the cargo hold area? I'm in no mood for jokes. No mistake, boss. And Benetrim was with them. This is true. What would they be doing there? With the Imperial border guards in the town, they were probably trying to avoid being spotted. That means 
Just like High Priestess Basanda said, they will try to return to the, to the Republic by train. So, oh, sorry, I missed that. Our brothers engaged them, right? Was the Sunrio's army dealt with? Actually, we were defeated. Actually, I would have liked a comma in that sentence. Useless wimps. Where are they now? They left Railhead, met a suspicious mercenary, and headed off towards the railway switching point. I see. They are still trying to get on the train. Good. Bandits, gather around. Looks like we found our bounty, Symbios and Menadrum. I think semicolon would have been better than a comma, but that's just me. Too bad most of our men are out with the ruins. And the, and the border guards will be waiting at the railway switching point. If the border guards don't get them, we should have a chance to finish them off and collect. Get it? Everyone ready? We need more men, boss. You two, go round up our mates. The rest of you birdmen carry us. We will meet up on the train. Get going. Alright, let's move. Did you hear that, Prince Million? Symbios and his army were in railhead, and now they're heading for the railway switching point. The road west goes too far out of the way. It will be next to impossible to catch up with Sheriff's gang. Well, let's just hop to it. However, yesterday General Spiriel took a path through the mountains. If we use that same route, we may be able to get to the switching point in time. That's a big if, though. And you'll see why. Some... <laughs> well, it is a very hectic battle. I will say that straight away, but... As to what makes it hectic, I guess I should just let you see for yourselves. Okay, so... No? I'm, so I'm told there's a back door. Oh, hello. Good to know in which we can find an item. Oh, look at that. That'll be sure. No. Who do we give that to? are not combat units, but you would benefit from it. Ah. Okay, I'll give it to Rock. Okay, let's get in from the front door this time. Like, <laughs> As if we know how to operate doors, you know? I really need this cup of tea. Pursue that line of reasoning. 
you don't mind. Thank you, game. Uh, yeah. Uh, <laughs> Okay, we have a man who pulls on High Priestess and she's in a bad mood because she was drinking. Or something. Uh, okay. So it's good to know that Sharaf's Kang has read the book on being good bandits. Move it. Huh. What is. It? Oh. Huh. That's Basanda. Do we a victory gesture kind of thing? Resign. Some misgivings here. Uh, see, Bernard is supposed to be waiting in this building, but I see no Bernard. I do not like this. Did I mess up the trigger by going into the back door first? If so, that is just annoying. Uh, let's see, no familiar face in here. But I did release Bernard in scenario one, right? You remember me doing that. So why isn't he here as he should be? I don't really want to go troubleshoot this on camera. to get inside that building. Okay, I'll go look for Bernard in here again. Maybe there's someone I should speak to? No. None of these are Bernard, that's for sure.
Uh, sure. Uh, mighty kind of you. Aha! Got you. This is not where uh, Joe Negro says he should be, but here he is. Awesome sauce. Prince Media. You, you were one of General Rogan's men. Bernard, correct? Why are you here not in Baron with the Rogan army? General Rogan sent me on a mission to gather information on the Balsam's Act. We're currently looking into the Balsam cult ourselves. What have you learned? I investigated Balsamo first. The Balsam sect rented the entire inn there. to King Benetrim along with the captive emperor as they were entering the inn. Uh, dot, 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 dot. I did what I could, but unfortunately I was captured. It appears you managed to escape. Actually, I was rescued. By whom, pray tell? It's very strange, but Symbios of the Republic rescued me. Time, I thought he was one of the abductors, so I threw some choice words at him and left. Well, we'll smooth it over for ya. I agree, Prince Medon. It's vital we catch up to Lord Symbios. We need to discover the truth. So why did you come here? I discovered a connection between the Balsam sect, Dusty Village, and Shiraf. When I was freed, I thought this place was worth investigating as well. Well, did you find anything? I'd be honored to join the Median army, that's not what I thought I asked about, but anyway, I'm certain General Rogan would approve. Together we'll figure out what role the Bolsonaro sect played in the Emperor's abduction. Okay. Yes. Finally found you, Bernard. Oh, wow, we have some level disparity here. Well, Bernard joins at level 3. Hmm. It's a fair attack, but his defense is just not good. Well, I mean, not that he needs to have a good defense, he's an archer, but still. Okay, so we have text instead of uh, icons for uh, magic uh, resistances. Mm -hmm. Ah, well. Oh. Okay. His defense score is just short of rocks. I guess his defense score is pretty good then. But Medion... Yeah, he's... <laughs> uh... Okay. You want Medion? Just... Don't, don't, don't have that defense bracer real quick, okay? Move. Give that to someone who needs it better. So 
Oh, he has 10 defense. Synthesis or Urging Doll? Hmm, I'm going with Uriro here actually. It could call me crazy, but I do like to get some good smacks in with my healers. <laughs> well, I guess you've seen that every so often. Um, okay, let's uh, just, uh, you know, get stuff done. Um, we have a battle to fight. We have to leave the city to do so. And... What is the game doing? Uh, where's the exit? Oh, it's over here. Wait, here we go. Lovely music for a stroll up the mountain. This mountain path is certainly steep. We should take our time and be careful. Yeah, let's not fall down and break every bone in our body. Oh, hi guys! They came out of nowhere. We're easy pickings for flying bandits up here. They raided us and flew off just like that. Damn bandits, now we're late for the rendezvous. We'll need to get a move on if we're going to catch up to the main armor force. Look, an Imperial army. Damn, they must have followed us. We suffered some injuries in our battle with the bandits, but we can handle that, Mega Force. All troops prepare for battle. Show them no mercy. They are preparing to attack. We will not be able to avoid battle. Let's get ready, Prince Medion. So. Oh, sorry. Prince Medion, our enemies have a great advantage from their higher elevation on the battlefield. Do not let your guard down. Okay, first of all, I am going to save the game. I was a little unnerved with the uh, uh, sort of reading shenanigans that was going on before. Now, the sort of gimmick with this battle is that it has a vertical component. Let's see, you say dwarf, you are an Espinianite. Uh, now, I did mention a battle that I found to be very hectic. I may have implied that it was this fight, but uh, that is obviously not the case. I do apologize for any inaccuracy I may have been uh, spouting. Uh, let's see. Yeah, I can put some uh, medium there. I should pull those dwarves and. Medion should have the weapon tribal advantage. Now, it would kind of make sense if the game was coded to take advantage of elevation in terms of accuracy and uh, whatever else. Like uh, Fire Emblem Radiant Dawn, for one. I'm fairly, I'm fairly sure it did. Otherwise, it would have been Path of Radiance for the GameCube. Uh, but it is a thing that people just do the whole line of sight and elevation thing with Jake. Um, okay, the dwarves aren't moving. I'll just come bust up some bats for you then. Hmm. Yeah, 
ja. I do not want to put synthesis anywhere near those dwarves, but I want to cast some magic spells too, you know? Oh well. Sometimes you just don't get what you want. Okay, Bernard is an archer with fair defense. Mitchell synthesis. At least since this can nail that one, um, one on just fine. Um, yeah, I guess walls can also do that. But yeah, back to the other uh, mountainous battle though. Um, yeah. When I describe it as hectic, I mean business. You will absolutely see what I mean. Thank you for the EXP. Just cleaning house. Slow down, boy. Eh, I don't care about antidote herbs. You don't have a whole lot of items on you though. Yeah, let's go give Bernard a few things. That sniper on the way. Yeah, okay. There we go. Uh, what? 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 Huh? Oh, uh, so, sorry, I, I just uh, got a weird streak from. Good old games. Apparently, I just got a soundtrack for free. Ah. Uh, uh. Okay. Uh, I. I. Um. Yeah, I'll have to look into that. Sorry about the distraction, but. <sighs> right. Great news for us. Do 
in this thing. Oh, but synthesis can uh, wreck some face. That's always good. Now, whenever you, whenever you feel like uh, learning place level two, that'll that'll be great. I'll have a grand old time with that spell. Is Mia really supposed to be this tough? I don't remember him being this good in my previous playthroughs. This will be interesting, I think. Yeah. It'll be very interesting to see where this ends up. I have to say. Uh, it's risky, but I think we'll be okay. Let's see how wrong I am then. This is awkward. And with my luck, right about now, that green knight is going to come out and... Oh, hello, look at this, I have luck for once. Um, yeah. There. Okay, never mind. All good now.
Mm, there's supposed to be a piece of mithril here somewhere. So is there anything else to look for? Uh huh. Yeah. There's supposed to be a, a, a human drop here as well. Ow. Take that. At place level 2. And do we have any MP to cast it with? That's kind of the interesting question. Hmm? Yeah. Why should we be able to cast place level 2 at least once? Triggered yet? <laughs> okay. Uh, that would be a good idea if you are not looking for a fight. I'm okay with that. These two have got to build us some friendship with this. <laughs> Not really much stats though. Well, me on in being mission critical and stuff. See, is this where I find the healing drop? It is not. Or is it here? Guess then that it would be the other one. Uh, well, that was not where I need to put you. Oh, 
That was not fantastic. to polish off the fight. Have an axe to the face. You imperial bastards set us up. You set up us to the bump. We bought King Bennett for more time, but we missed our own chance to escape. Now death awaits. All of this, ugh, because the Empire Saraband framed us for the Emperor's abduction. You'll pay for this. You'll get what you deserve. Well, this all sounds like a big under misunderstanding. More evidence of the Republic's innocence. But then why has the Emperor been seen with King Benetron? It is difficult to say, Campbell, but what happened here only reassures me that we need to speak with the Symbios army. The switching point should be just on the other side of this mountain. If we find the Symbios army there, perhaps we will be able to ascertain the truth. Let's go. Oh right, there was actually weather here too. Too much fun playing the game to notice those things sometimes. Look, there's the switching point. That looks like Wardegar is stationed at the switching point. If the Symbios army shows up, a battle will certainly ensue. Well, have at them! Oh, uh. Yikes, refugees! We remember how this ended up, right? Oh, this is just great. If those refugees are, spo are spotted, the border guards will attack them for sure. And try as I might, I rescued all of one of them. After repeated attempts. And there is... yes, that's the Republican General Varland. His presence will complicate the situation even further. You don't say. Let's let you play this map before. Yet more Imperial troops have arrived. The stage is rather crowded, but where is Symbios? This is a rather difficult situation. The refugees are in danger from both the Border Guards and the Republic Army. We can barely hear them from here, let's get a little closer. Oh, 
I want you to do that, General Roland. Damn, we've been flanked. Border guards, your infamy is well known. I won't let you attack these people so mercilessly. You failed me, Varland. Punishing those that seek asylum within us being is against the very principles upon which the Republic was founded. Well, well, the symbiotes are. I suppose it's foolish of me to ask, but are you here to assist me? We do not intend to stand by and allow you to place military considerations above humanity. Shut up, you must not know the world. What do you know? Peace is kept because of our soldiers. No country can survive without a military. Well, Sweden and Switzerland are making a good attempt of it, though. You've been through many fierce battles, and your anger is understandable. Nevertheless, wouldn't it be better if we could return to the Republic peacefully? How many have died from Imperial plots? I've lost so many soldiers. I'll kill every last Imperial soldier and burn the Empire to the ground. Have you lost your mind, General Marlant? You don't appear willing to listen to reason. We will protect those defenseless refugees from all aggressors. Uh, you've got some help, you know. Hi. You so far awesome stuff, you know. Lord Salad. Prince Medion, why have you come here? Well, to chat with you. We need to have, a, have some talk about the abduction, right? People can't choose where they're born, but they should have the right to choose where they live. Although it's a little discouraging to see people leaving their homeland. Yeah, let us deal with one, okay? Mark my words, you who threaten civilians seeking asylum are on thin ice. The Minion Army will not allow your safe to go punished. Let's do this. We will trust our backs to you and Prince Million. We will do everything in our power to protect the refugees from the border guards. We will handle the Norvalis forces. We will make sure they don't lay a finger on those refugees. Huh, big talkers. You're lucky we took losses in a battle with the Spirial Army, otherwise you wouldn't stand a chance. Synthesis. If you're afraid, you can hide behind me. Afraid? Me, please. You are the one who should be hiding behind me, you weirdo. You are both plain to I'm sure you'll be fine. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, this is the last fight of chapter one. Let's see, uh, we should be seeing a few. Oh, hello. Yeah. Why did I do this? Nothing very much. Okay. So we have a few new enemies here. Let's just focus on those. Uh, spinning image. Yeah, the uh, seven hit point variant. Uh, priests, uh, fifteen hit points, twelve MP. Uh, I've seen those before. Merman, same as before. Marlins is new though. Um, sixty hit points is a fair amount. His stats, though, are not very much to be afraid of. So, you know, let's just uh, call it a day and get back with some real uh, centaur smacking tomorrow. Until then.